even if it does not exceed 3.5 meters in length, it's one of the most extreme and exciting boats in the world. Like its name implies, Moth International flies more than it floats. For skipper Sebastian Jos, the new world monohull speed record holder, the stopover in Melbourne was a unique chance to try out this amazing skiff. Along with his New Zealand watch captain, Scott Beavers, they take lessons from the Moth world champion, Rowan Veal. With this sort of a boat, the, the idea is to get the boat going as fast as possible and you can um, sit at the back of the boat and it, will, and it will lift the bow up and then it will fly and then you can level it out and it will just go. Although the instructions look simple, starting is easier said than done, even for these two experienced sailors. You've got to be going fast through the tack. The tiller's stuck. <laughs> Invented in Australia in 1928, Moth International has been constantly improving its design ever since. Year after year, major innovations have been added. These include wings, using carbon fiber materials, and in the last four years, even hydrofoil technology. The, on the rudder, there's also a hydrofoil, and using the tiller extension, what you twist here, you can adjust the angle of the flap on the back. And that's like a trim tab on an aeroplane, and uh, you're always playing that when you're sailing the boat. On se retrouve à un mètre au-dessus de l'eau, donc euh, on se retrouve avec 20 cm, 20 cm carré euh, dans l'eau et, et 10 mètres carrés au-dessus de voile, au-dessus de, de l'eau. Donc on sent, en fait, on sent plus la friction, on sent plus, le, on sent plus les vagues, il n'y a plus de bruit. Et puis, ça, et puis ça, on est tout de suite à 15-20 nœuds avec un bateau qui fait 2 mètres 30. C'est vraiment impressionnant. 